Let's Neva for Manic Mama Musings, and it's chilly today. We had to get out and get a few things. Um, ham is on sale, and I didn't get one at Christmas time, and I'm really wanting a ham. And pork chops are on sale too. We haven't had those in a while, and LJ wants pork chops, so we're gonna go grab some and maybe something easy for dinner tonight. Just because it's his first night Hello. back, and Hello. Kept an amazing. Um, it's his first night back, and so, uh, and it's cold, so it's kind of napping weather. So I'll just get something easy for dinner. So yeah, it's cold. I don't know what the temperature is, but I'm freezing. It's 39 right there. 39 degrees. I'm glad he points out the obvious because <laughs> I wasn't thinking to look there. No, I said I'm glad. Okay. So yeah. Anyway, so I'm freezing. We're about to get out and get some groceries and come back home. Yes, we went grocery shopping, but mainly just for the stuff for lasagna the other night. And so we'll get a few more things today. And I hope you are inside and warm wherever you're at. Or, yeah, I hope you're not cold like me. So there you go. See you in a little bit. <laughs> There's the llama, guys. <laughs> oh, that's cute. Here's a gnome. I saw him. Look, Ashley. <laughs> Here's the pig, guys. Oh, it's not. It's not wanting to do anything. Okay. There we go. <laughs> oh, he's killing me. <laughs> Get down. <laughs> Here's a doggy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Here's a Viking, I guess. I get a Viking to you. Oh my gosh. Oh, he doesn't move. Maybe he's supposed to move and he doesn't. Tiger, y'all. <laughs> it's a flashing tiger. Hot, hot, hot. Oh, that's too cute. Uh, y'all know I gotta share these with y'all. Here's a banana, y'all. Bananas for you. <laughs> That's too cute. <laughs> Here's a dragon, y'all. Let's see. Where did I see the button? Oh, there. <laughs> I love dragons. Oh, it's cute. <laughs> Hi y'all, I told you we were going to do more fun things this year, and considering that, well, okay, this is being videotaped on Saturday, because he's off, we'll be played on Sunday, but anyway, hence I have the same clothes on, the same Thank clothes you. on, yeah. okay, these are shrimp crackers that we got at um, the, the Oriental store that we have, um, La Crochet Life and Stuff with Deborah does um, snacks from around the world. And we went in looking for a cuttlefish snack. Don't judge me. I still didn't find it. I was sad because that's what I wanted. But we did find something to try. You want to put that up close so they can see the package? Certainly. This is shrimp crackers. Shrimp crackers. Everything on it is in Korean. And so is the back. 
No, there's some English stuff in there. Well, yeah. Not everything. Yeah, it has uh, words in Korean, and um, it says it contains wheat, shrimp, anchovy, soy, and milk. Manufactured in a facility that also... Oh, we don't need all that. Nong Shim Company Limited in Seoul, Korea. And the lady that runs the shop, we should probably videotape a little bit sometime when we're going. She's very sweet. She's elderly. She's had that shop there. We're not in that exact spot, but she's had one here for since I can remember. Um, there's one next to her, but they're not as friendly. But um, I worry about when she can't run her shop anymore because I truly do love going there. My daughter's. Um, are vegetarian and they make a lot of Asian foods. Um, I don't know if that's got to do with the vegetarian thing, but they do make like homemade Asian food and they go there for a lot of their stuff. We do not have access to a lot of different stores here. Um, Deborah goes to a place called H Mart. We don't have that here. And we looked online for snacks from, but they're expensive. So, we're going to try these. All that talking to say we're going to try these. Shrimp crackers. I just order candy and stuff from Japan on Amazon. And it's pretty pricey. It's like calorie meat. I don't know if I like that smell. Oh, it smells like fish. Like a fish bowl or fish food. Mm, I'm not sure what that smells like. Here, you take one first. Yeah, it smells like fish food and fish food has shrimp in it. By the way, what we ate last night, uh, I forgot to say... The, the the fake chicken, the, the whatever, the dare, um, vegetable-based chicken product. I don't know what it's called. Anyways, it was delicious. I mean, I'm not going to say that, you know, ooh, it tasted like chicken. But it was a nice protein substitute, and it was very, it was good. It was edible. Um, we ate it on a salad. My daughters said it would be good if you added sweet and sour to it, which I think it would. They have a breaded one that maybe we'll try that next. So today, we're trying the shrimp. I don't like the smell of it. I've um, eaten fish food before. Let's, let's put it in our mouth at the same time. One, two, three. It's a fishy Cheeto. It tastes better than it smells. Yeah, it does. Oh, he wants some too? Yeah. So actually mm -hmm. giving them to the cat. These were sitting there for a while and we were just like, oh man, I gotta try them because I, I wanted something salty and it's not as salty as I wanted it to be. But it's good for a snack though. Our turtles all drinking water. A fishy beer. Cheeto. That's what it is. Ew. Fishitos. So. Okay. So. Would I buy them just because, would I crave them? No. I don't think I would either. If they were given to me, would I eat them again? Yes. Would I go out of my way to buy them again? No. It has a very strong fish taste. Yes. Not bad, but it tastes like a fishy Cheeto. Lucy. So, that is our snack. Um... I was going to say out of this world snack. That's not it. This our, is our, a snack from a different country. Yes. It is. I would love it if people could send me snacks from different places, different parts of the U.S. and yeah, Especially from overseas, like Ireland it, it and would be so England cool. and stuff. But, like, shipping is ridiculous. So you yes. figure if you're actually, like, ordering from, yeah. But, um... We did this for you. Um, it has mushroom extract. That should make it taste good. It has good. a whole lot of stuff. Enriched wheat flour, reduced uh, do, 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 seasoned oil, rice bran oil, palm oil, dried shrimp, citric acid, cornstarch, ground shrimp, modified tapioca starch, sugar, salt, shrimp extract powder. Now, yeah, so basically it's a bag of MSG. Okay, cool. Let's see. A whole lot of, yeah. A bag of Metal Gear Solid. Oh, wait, that's MGS. So, yes. Um, total sugars, one gram for uh, per serving and three grams for the whole bag. That's all right. So, that's not bad. I mean, the right mind would just Carbs, it's 18 things. grams per serving, 48 per bag. Um, protein, two grams. 
per serving, five per bag. Um, yeah, I can s still eat them. I don't think they're um, very healthy for you. No, they're not, but I mean, it's a, it's a joke. again, it's I anything. Mean, I said it's a fishy Cheeto. Like, okay, so, there you go, guys. There is our snack that we, our snack review, shrimp crackers from Nongshin. Yum. Yum, yum. Let me turn it up again. Okay. Good pal. Ow! Get it, Beanie. Get him, Beanie. Get him, Beanie. The sweetest girl. <laughs> Hi y'all, it's Neva from Manic Mama Musings and man has it been a long time. Yeah. So what have I been up to? Having migraines, that's what I've been up to. So I'm sorry I haven't been on in a while, but um excuse me, sorry. What's in my cup? I don't have a cup right now. I have a can, it's Diet Pepsi. I'm waiting for the kiddos. I brought them grocery shopping, the twins. So, yeah. Um, but uh, I've not been up to much sleeping, trying to get rid of migraines and, yeah, and that kind of stuff. Uh, we did watch the movie Selma last night. If you have not watched that, we watched it on Peacock. Um, that's uh, an app you can get on your Roku TV. And it was free to watch on Peacock, and it's an excellent movie. I've I not watched it. I feel bad I hadn't watched it. It was an excellent, excellent movie about Martin Luther King, and I enjoyed it. Um, and I think the night before that, we watched Lake Placid, because y'all know I'd be loving some Betty White. And um, we found it on YouTube, and it's in English. It has subtitles in another language, but it speaks in English, so... Um, if I remember, I'll put the link to that video down below. But yes, yeah, so watch movies and crochet. That's pretty much it because I had migraines. And um, yeah, I've been working on some stuff, but uh, I'll show that in some other videos. Um, I haven't done any cooking since I made the liver and onions the other night. It was so good. I know. A lot, a lot of people can't stand liver and onions. But there's a few who like it. Those I think those people... the You either really love it or you can't stand it. It's not a eh, in-between thing. And I understand. Um, Me, growing up, my sisters hated it. I was the only one of us kids that liked it. And my oldest daughter likes it, but my other two don't. My husband, LJ, thinks it's eh. And Faustine, her fiancé, doesn't like it much. So, yeah. Sorry, guys. They got me out of the house, and I'm hoping we get home before the wind starts blowing. Because if the wind starts blowing, I'm liable to have another headache. I think I'm going to see the doctor. I'm going to make an appointment. Um, the twins have an appointment on Thursday and I may go ahead and make me one for that day too. Just cause I think it's my sinuses. I feel real, um, not, you know, anything else, not in my lungs or nothing, but up in here. And so I think that that's what it is. And, uh, mm, let me think what else do I have to talk about? I've got a lot of clips of stuff to put together, and I still haven't done my Ancestry.com thing. I still gotta do that. So this video might just be um, a lot of clips put together and this intro right here. Because I've got clips that I've been saving to put all together for a video for a while. Um, I'm probably gonna do a mental, I'm gonna try to do a Mental Health Monday today. No promises. I know it's a Tuesday, but a Mental Health Monday on a Tuesday. Um, because I have my sneak to show that I've been crocheting. 
But if not, I'll, you know, I'll do one next Monday. Because, uh, I got a few other videos to make, too. I haven't made a blanket one. I started my de decrease, though. I've got three decreases in now, I think. Anyway. And it's not as hard as I made it out to be. And I feel really dingy thinking about how many I could have um, made already. So, yeah. Feel a little slow about that. But I started some other stuff that I'm excited to tell about. But I want to do them in a different video. So, um. I hope everybody's doing good. Apart, I think why I'm having the headaches and my sinuses are all messed up is because we're getting really cold at night and getting up to like 65 in the day. And that might not seem hot, but when you go from 20 degrees at night to 65 in the day, it messes with my sinuses, y'all. And on top of that, we've not gotten cold and stayed cold long enough to kill off a lot of stuff. Like... No, we didn't have a winter yet. I'm going to say we haven't because then we'll get stuck with some nasty, ugly stuff. But we've not had a winter yet. Like, we've had one snow. No rain, no nothing, one snow. And it, before that had been a long time before it even rained. So, yeah. Might be happening to move somewhere else that isn't so dry. But, um... Yeah, so I I for sure, if I don't go to the doctor, I for sure am getting my booster on Thursday if I can get it scheduled at the hospital. When I take the girls to the doctor. So, yeah, there's that. Um, and I need to get my flu shot, for sure. But I don't really go anywhere, and so I try not to go unless I have to. But the girls gotta go, and so it, I might as well do what I need to do. And people watching. Sorry, guys. Shouldn't be doing that while I'm talking to y'all, huh? Uh, we could use some good vibes coming our way. LJ's trying to straighten something out. and It's nothing bad, but it's, re it's something really good if he can get it straightened out. So, it's not, the, it's not anything that, like, if it doesn't happen, it's the worst thing ever. But it's something that it would help if if it went through so I just put it that way I'm not gonna talk in detail about it just something we need some prayers and good vibes for and um I think I'm gonna let you guys go I feel like I haven't talked to y'all in forever and I feel a little out of practice or something well and I really don't know what to say because I don't have my book here um and so I don't have any of my quotes or anything I need to get back to scheduling out what I'm going to talk about and whatnot but um I hope you guys are having a good week it's just Tuesday and so you know I don't know what's the weather like there you know how are y'all doing weather wise and anything crazy happen in your way nothing real exciting happening here I do have stuff to talk about in other videos so be watching if I can get back into making videos today so far fingers crossed no headache i had one yesterday and then i didn't have one the day before but i was recovering from having one for three days straight and when i have migraines like that i am even the next the day after i'm very sensitive to light and i don't i'm nauseous and but the tummy's feeling better i'm not sensitive to light right now um yesterday's was i just slept all day I didn't even try to stay awake. I slept all day and then I was up crocheting last night. And so I'll probably be napping later today. But so I love y'all. I will get back to you very, very soon with some other videos. Mwah.